So we're going to be having a look at some of the automatic systems we have on the machines now as well. Some of these systems will be standard to your machine, and some will either depend on the configuration or the optional offering. From the main SEBA screen, we can actually see how some of these automatic systems are enabled. We can see the outline of our combine with the various systems available to us. And then next to these systems, we can see a little A. And that A is obviously standing for automatics. So for example, here I can see I have CMOS automatics available to my threshing system and my cleaning system and my chopping system. Again, this being a straw walker machine, I don't have any available on my straw walkers. When these automatics are in use, all I have to do is press the auto button on the joystick to enable them and the lights will pop up green accordingly. If I want a more in-depth look at my automatics, I can go across to now my display screen free. And here I have a good view of the automatic systems in full. It's a very quick and easy way to access various automatic systems on the machine. So if I have, for example, the likes of Cruise Pilot on my machine, I can tap into the Cruise Pilot button and it quickly brings up some of my Cruise Pilot offerings. Again, if I need to adjust any of my automatics, my CMOS sections, my CMOS automatics, I can click into the lights of my CMOS cleaning and I can either turn on or off my CMOS cleaning. Another quick way I can adjust the likes of my automatic settings is by going into the CMOS section here at the top. If I click CMOS and have CMOS enabled in my CBA screen, I can then have quick access to adjust the likes of my CMOS strategy. However, this is a little area we'll be taking a little bit more of an in-depth look at in a separate video. Additionally, away from the main screen as well, I can access the likes of my automatic settings through the automatics menu down the right-hand side. This is gonna give me the same views that I can have on my main home screen. However, we'll then go into a little bit more detail in terms of adjustable settings. So for example, I can go in and set all of my cruise pilot parameters. I also have from this main screen, the likes of my automatic steering as well. So the steering system is available on the machine. I can quickly go in and turn the steering on or off, or I can select my various guide sensors too. So that's just a good quick overview of the automatic settings and how we can quickly access various menus and various settings on the go when we're in the machine. If you take a look at our separate videos, we'll be having a look at these automatics in more detail of the main workings and how to adjust them.